The day after I posted my video, JB King discovered a new way to create the Philosopher's Stone setup with only one instance of Terraria, and then Yuri refined it to what you see here. Start by placing 8 blocks in this pattern around the wire. Then place either a sand or a dirt block here, then 2 more blocks, and a bass statue here. Place the sand above the left side of the bass statue, then a trapdoor here, and 2 sand on top of it. Mine the right side of the bass statue, then place it again here, and update the sand with a torch. If you placed a sand before, now place a sandstone block here, but since I placed a dirt block, I'll place a stone block here. When cleaning up, start with this block, otherwise it may break the bass statue. If you don't plan on relogging to make the bass statue visible, I would recommend placing a torch here, so that you know whether the bass statue is on or off at all times. If you don't acquire enough iron or lead to make a trap door, there is another method of doing it that starts in single player. Place your sand or dirt block again, then starting from here, place a workbench, two sand on top, another workbench, and two more sand on top. Then place a bass statue, and mine the right side of the workbench. Now you need to log out and log back in with multiplayer, which is why this method is slower. Once you've logged back in, place a torch here, and then place either your sandstone or stone block here. And just like before, the bass statue is invisible but still functional. Have fun transmuting!